Hello fellow engineers, welcome to another Kerbal Space Program episode. Uh, last time ended like this. Oh, if we slow down. Shit. Uh, where's my, where's uh, Jebediah gone? Turns out Jebediah was fine, nothing to worry about. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna lift, I'm gonna try and split these apart a bit. So let's move that down there for now. Where's the decoupler thing? So I got a decoupler, so that goes in the middle. Right, so essentially the first thing when I press spacebar is we take off. Then the second time I hit spacebar, that comes apart from each other. Oh, which means I'll lose all my science, does it? Yeah, so I better move them. So I'll bung my thermometer on there. I'll bung that antenna on the back there. Okay, yeah, so now when I do that, all my science is still up here. And then my parachute last. So it does mean I'll lose all this rocket, but hopefully it means... Jebediah won't die? <laughs> I don't know why, I don't know what's happened this time. I don't know. <laughs> okay, we've run out. Uh, space seat, fuck me. <laughs> that nearly took an eye out. <laughs> oh, Jebediah's loving it, look at him. Okay, so now hopefully if I hit space, a parachute should open, should open. Should open. <laughs> Open! <laughs> Quick, I need the SAS! I need the SAS! <laughs> what does that do? Whoa, there's my rocket! Whoa, look at it, look at it! Okay, so that wasn't the best, but I got a fair bit of science. I got five. So let's go and see what else we can upgrade. Ooh, boosters, that sounds fun. So we got some more stuff, so that's cool. So let's build a better rocket. And I want to get some readings from space this time. So I'm determined to go high. So there's a fair amount of fuel and rocket shit there. So radial decoupler. Oh, so I think this is how you bung rockets on the side. So I've got eight of those, <laughs> which means I can bung eight of these on the side. All right, so we can put some nose cones on. Excellent. We can do some fins. Look at that. That actually looks like it could be successful, maybe. I'm not going to go for landing strut. I think that's a bit advanced at this stage. Oh, I'm moving the whole thing around. So do I need to put a heat shield between? So if I put a heat shield there, and then my decoupler, and then the rest of the rocket, then should I get into space, when I come back down, I won't melt. I think that's how it works. Okay, so what I'm thinking... Hopefully how this will work. All those rockets will go. That will let us take off. Then I detach all those rockets. Then I use the smaller one to go a bit higher. And then I detach. And then parachute safety. Seems like a good plan. Will it be one though? Who knows? I'm sure someone watching knows. But I have no idea. Plus side, we are just about balanced on that rocket. <laughs> I'm a bit worried when I set these off. That will just melt that one. But there's only one way to find out, so I'm gonna wang my throttle to a hundred, and uh, let's go. Oh crap! Look how fast it is. Jebediah's loving it. Well, he doesn't look so sure anymore. We are on. Look at the flames. We are spinning. Oh my god! So the fuel's about to run out. So when that gets low, I'm gonna hit space. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. We're spinning. So we are going super fast, but we're spinning. So I'm going to do a bit of that. Oh, shit. We're spinning. We're spinning. We're spinning. Oh, no. I just pressed space. Wait, what did that do? I think my parachute just went off. My decoupler didn't work for some reason. Hey, my throttle's completely off, but that rocket's still going mental. I'm just gonna keep it in space. No, not a clue what I did. <laughs> oh well, while we're here, we'll try and get some science going. So now the question, do I still have a parachute? Well, hang on, we're still going up. Are we not gonna come back down? Okay, so we've kind of stopped spinning now. So I should be able to do... Oh, can I just log? Surely that's a bit of a hack. So I can log all these pressures and I get the science every time, do I? Okay, we're falling back down. That's good, that's good. Let's speed up and see, is our parachute gonna come out? 
Oh, hang on, hang on. Alright, so this is where we've got our heat shield. Which might save us. I'm a bit scared. Oh, so our heat shield got us through. So I'm wondering... Yes, the parachute! Is it going to open? Because we're still going bloody quick. Shit. Okay, it's open, it's open. Hang on, where's all the water gone? All the water's disappeared. What? <laughs> What's happened? Well, that was strange. Alright, so I'm going to bung a few more fins. I'm going to put four fins. Okay, I'm going to put eight fins <laughs> on this bit. Just so when this thing disappears, we might still be able to steer and not go absolutely mental. Alright, so wang the old throttle up to 100. And here we go! <laughs> yes. Oh, we're starting to go sideways a bit. It's not too bad. Alright, so they're done, so space. Oh, shit and out. The bloody explosion did us. I'm gonna try and rotate this. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we've got a backwards rocket right now. Oh, bollocks. I just did the bloody parachute again. Right, that's a fail. What is that? What's going on? What? Oh, my fins are blowing up. <laughs> oh, look, we're trying to get unstuck. But there's too much pressure. There you go. Whoa. <laughs> oh, man, look at it go. See ya. Okay, so we landed. I'll take that. <laughs> Partial success. Oh, look at that! That's like the, our best one yet. 17 science points. Okay, command pod is a go. We now have bigger fuel tanks, so I don't think that's ever been a bad thing. I feel like the eight boosters really did work. So they're gonna go on there. Oh, we've got big, big boosters now. Uh, that's not what I want. <laughs> I am intrigued to see what that will do though. I just really want to see what's gonna happen here. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Look at that! What have I done? Look into my eyes! <laughs> you are feeling sleepy. Oh my god! It's taking off like a helicopter! I think I built a helicopter! Wow. Okay, so that was a lot of fun. But my actual intention was... Game, why must you tempt me? Why? I'm trying to do this properly. Right, I don't even know if they're attached by the decoupters. Hopefully they are. They've all kind of merged into one as well. Uh, we'll just wang the old nose cone on. And we could be good to go. Whoa. Okay, come on, we got this. We are going to get into space for sure. Bollocks. Maybe eight is too many. Let's just do six. I feel like six is a bit easier to track. Are they attached? <laughs> oh, I think they're actually attached by it. All right, nose cones, nose cones. Oh, and we need some fins, don't we? Right, I've actually done research and I'm pretty confident this is going to... Why don't rockets in real life look like this? <laughs> Didn't really think that one through, did I? Anyway, up we go. That's not looking too bad. If we just believe, then I think we'll be okay. Just keep going up. Nothing wrong with up. We are using some fuel as well. Holy shit. Right, so we're out of fuel. I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait till we slow down a bit before I decouple. Because I'm trying to minimize explosions. So, now. Oh. <laughs> yes. Okay, okay. This is actually looking good. Alright, so don't spin too much. Don't spin too much. So if I can face the right direction. And then hit it. We are off. See ya, guys. See ya. Oh, fuck. I pressed the wrong one again. Okay, we're decoupled. We're decoupled. I always seem to do that. Oh, and also, I've got no bloody science on my rocket. Damn it. <laughs> right, so I've added some science this time. So now there is actually reason for us going into space, which is always good. Uh, throttle up, let's go. And I gotta, I gotta keep my thumb away from the space bar. I only want to press it when I want something to happen. I'm very twitchy 
Okay, I don't think this is looking too bad. I can't seem to steer, which is a bit annoying, but it is what it is. Again, we're going to wait until we slow down a bit. So we're not exactly slowing down. <laughs> uh, but we've stopped glowing. So I'm going to press it now. Oh, okay. Now I'm going to gently, gently steer. And then with my throttle a bit lower, about a third, I'm going to try and go around the planet. See you, rockets. Thanks for getting us into space. For some reason, we seem to be doing circles. <laughs> I don't know how to control this thing. <laughs> right, what does right do? I don't know where I'm going. Toggle map. Ah! Yes, we can finally see where we're going to go. How long of a name will fit in this text box? I see the text is getting smaller and now it is even moving across the text box to... Okay, so this is our current trajectory. Which doesn't look good. I would like to try and move it. But I don't know how. Uh, while we're here, I'm going to... Have a look at the mystery goo. Oh, I got no science. We've already done that one. It's so hard to click on any of these. Stop moving! Temperature. 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 Damn it. Temperature. 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 You need better reactions on this than bloody Counter-Strike, I swear. Ah! Oh, I just pressed the SAS button because I knew they'd help me. And I think that allows Jebediah to do stuff. So now if I go into map, we're still crashing to our death. <laughs> uh, one second. Right, so we're trying to get to orbit. We're slowly doing it, but I think our fuel is going to run out. Are we going to make it? Bollocks. Well, anyway, we had fun. <laughs> we'll just speed up time a bit. Okay, so we're heading back to Earth. So I'm going to get rid of that. And then hopefully... There you go. Now our heat shield should save us. We've got a rocket behind us. Oh shit, it's gonna hit us, it's gonna hit us. Oh god, that was close. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that blew up pretty quickly. Okay, so I think SAS actually is just stability something. It wasn't our Kerbin. I gave him too much credit. You're just a passenger, aren't you? And then I'm gonna hit my parachute. I guess now, I don't really, I don't know when you're meant to or meant to not. Parachute. Tell you what, just in case you don't land it, I'm going to extend. Oh no, destroy it. No, I'm not. I'm just going to leave it where it is because <laughs> I know just from engineering instincts, if I were to extend that, it would be destroyed. So I don't want to do that. We'll speed that up, and I think that is mission accomplished. We'll just see how many science points we got. Oh, we got 21 science points. Excellent. So we did pretty well there. Right, so next time we'll be spending some of those points. But yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Hope... I feel like I got worse as the game progressed. But but I also feel like a little bit... I know a bit more how stuff works. I know about decoupling now. And parachutes and staging. Yeah, I think I learned something. I just feel like I did better when I didn't know about those things. <laughs> anyway guys, peace, love and bridges. I'll catch you next time. Bye!